Let's simplify these indices together. Now you can pause this video and give these questions a try and see what you get. Simplify 2 whole number 1 over 4 all raised to the power minus 1 over 2. Now when you have a mixed fraction like this in indices, whether it's in the base or the power, you want to change this mixed fraction to an improper fraction. So that this, you know, when you change this to improper fraction, this will be 4 times 2 plus 1. 4 times 2 is 8 plus 1 is 9. So we have 9 over 4. This as an improper fraction. Then, the power, this is raised to the power minus 1 over 2. The power, if there's a negative to it, you want to remove it. So we're going to remove that negative sign. And to do that, we have to invert the base of these indices. So the 4 will go up and the 9 will come down. So we can safely remove the negative sign now. So that this will be 4 over 9 raised to power 1 over 2. Now I can write this as 2 raised to power 2. 4 is the same thing as 2 raised to power 2. 9 is the same thing as 3 raised to power 2. And this is all raised to power 1 over 2. This 1 over 2, this power is both for the numerator and the denominator because of these brackets. So this power, I can write this as 2 raised to power 2, then times this power, times 1 over 2, over 3 raised to power 2, times this power, 1 over 2. This will cancel, this will cancel. So I'm left with 2 over 3. And that is the answer. I've simplified this and I've gotten my answer as 2 over 3. I hope you are enjoying this video. If you are, like it, share it so more kids can see this. And if you want to get some of my simplified math videos for free, videos where I make math simple and easy to understand, I make math friendly, click on the link above or below this video and I will send you those videos for free. Click on the link above or below this video and I'll send you those videos for free. Now let's do the next one. Simplify the cube root of 4 raised to the power 1.5. The cube root of 4 So here I would first of all change this. This 1.5 I'll change it to an improper fraction. So when you have decimal or a mixed fraction, change them to improper fractions. So this will be cube root of 4. 1.5 is the same thing as 1 and half. And changing this to an improper fraction, 2 times 1 is 2 plus 1 is 3. So this will be 3 over 2. So I can write this as 3 over 2. Good. Now, cube root, cube root, if you are writing it as a power, like maybe you have cube root of 4, how you write this will be 4 raised to the power 1 over 3. This cube root, another way to write it is 1 over 3. If it is 4th root, maybe this is 4, this will be 1 over 4. If it is 5th root, this will be 1 over 5, and so on. Okay? So this will be 4, 3 over 2, then cube root will be 1 over 3. Now multiplying the powers, 3 we cancel 3, and we have 4 raised to the power 1 over 2. I can write this as 2 raised to the power 2. 4 is the same thing as 2 raised to the power 2, then times this power, 1 over 2. This will cancel, and we are left with just... Two. So our answer is 2. Alright, now if you want to get some of my simplified math videos, as I said, click on the link above or below this video and I will send you the videos for free. See you in the next one.